It was snowing this morning guys, it was magical, a very winter wonderland, lucky land. This morning we are inside the van. Lucia, good morning, amore. Here you go. Ciao. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> and we are in the van because we are going to the doctor first for Luce, the pediatrician, and then we are going to buy the Christmas tree, the first one for Luce this year. And we have here. Good morning, beautiful people. My love. Hello, my love. Dad love. wants to drive this morning. Yes, of course. This is the second time we are using the van. So we are pretty excited, even if it's just for, you know, run some errands today. But we are in the van. <laughs> Let's go. This morning was snowing, and now we have a beautiful sunny day. tire yet on the van and it, the, the, the road is completely frozen it's black ice so we are on the first gear we are going really slow how are you feeling amore? It feels good back on the road for the first time Luce is super healthy, she's growing perfectly, we couldn't be happier and now we are going to find the perfect Christmas tree for this year. Yes, we are on a mission. <laughs> it feels so good to be back in the van, it feels so, I don't know, uh, liberating. Freedom, a, a sense, sense of, of uh, being able to move. Uh, What's the plan, my love? Search for the perfect Christmas tree. The rule is always the perfect Christmas tree is the one that touches the ceiling of your house, in my opinion. So bigger it is, better it is. I love big Christmas trees. The smell of the pine, of the spruce is amazing. I can't wait to start decorating the tree this year with Lucha for the first time. Last year I was pregnant. This year will be even more special. It will be the three of us all together. It was not... I was not 100% sure about this Christmas. If you ask me two weeks ago, three weeks ago, uh, I always try to stay positive and I always try to be optimistic and think the best way possible. But I was really scared about Luca's situation and his condition but now really is such a gift to have him with us this year first stop on breastfeeding Luce Beautiful people, we found some beautiful trees uh, and uh, they are alive, uh, they are in the, um, in the pot. They're really big and expensive, uh, so we need to think about it. Uh, it's about 450 
and the first shop they were 32 euros or 35 euro they're different very small. different plants different everything these are just the, the two first i would like to see more and more and more yes. we'll <laughs> so the search searching. continues yes 380 wow they are so expensive this one is beautiful as well Another stop. Yes, we're checking <laughs> all of them. Hundred and seventy-five, two hundred and twenty-five. Yeah, you can see this is four hundred and fifty euros, uh, and this is eighty euros. Uh, yeah, so but you can uh, see the difference between a uh, spruce and a uh, pine. And we are having lunch in a van. For the first time. Are you happy, Lucia? So nice. It feels uh, freedom. It feels... Uh, where do you want to go, Sarah? Just drive and go and be free, explore so nice you just turn the seat uh, and you have your table ah this is beautiful and it's comfortable it's very nice what's inside, inside? I'm not <laughs> tomato and cheese or ham and cheese mm. You want this one? Yes, of course. <laughs> it's heavy, Lucia. It's bigger than your face. <gasps> this is not too big for you. What do you think? <laughs> for mommy, yes. Um. <laughs> boo boo. found the one we don't know if this one or that one so this is abias nord maniana this is the species we like the one that cost 500 euro because it was bigger in the other place and this one is 70 euro we will plant this in our garden at Luckyland. so we are good to go Amore, guarda. Guarda, Mission accomplished, guys. So as you can see, it's not touching the ceiling of the van. <laughs> so it's not so big, but at least this is alive and we can plant this in our garden. We bought it the same year Lucia was born, the first Christmas of Lucia. It can still fit in the van for a few years <laughs> if we want to celebrate Christmas around the world, traveling. This small now, it will get bigger. It's a long 
project, uh, future project. Since we are in the van um, and talking about van life uh, for future projects, uh, a few days ago at Luckyland, we got a visit from some van lifers' friends. Yeah, so this is something that we would like to keep doing for the next months since we are not able to travel uh, long term and long distance. Because every week I need to go to the hospital for some checkups, uh, some blood tests. Uh. We really love the idea to invite van lifers, travelers, YouTubers, friends to spend some time together and yeah, just share our experience and make friends from, from social media friends to real life friends. Exactly. So let's see who came to visit us last week. Today we have some friends coming over to our place to Luckyland. So we went to buy some traditional extra virgin olive oil breadstick and some bread, some pane. In this area they are very good baking bread. Breadsticks, uh, we call them a grissini here in Italy. Yes, right. And I love them. Oh guys, a quick video to show you when you arrive, uh, what you need to do. You need to go left up here just forward like our van and uh, this is our house and you can park uh, here so we have uh, water and electricity hello beautiful girls hello we are waiting for our friends yes they will be showing up from there yeah and we already prepared uh, we have water here and we have electricity so we they have can park here so they can have access to the bathroom that is here really close to the hour entrance just just over here we have the bathroom because we can relate they prefer to sleep in their own van it's something that we also loved when we were traveling with Lucky Liu <laughs> You know, a lot of people offer us to stay inside. We accept it several times, especially when it was very cold weather. <laughs> but then usually we prefer to sleep in our own bed. Uh, but then it's nice to have access to the bathroom. If they want to do laundry, if we want, they can take a shower, a hot tub. So, and they can have electricity that is always pretty nice. And water. And water. Let's that, uh, go. On, on the van, uh, it's always uh, limited. Exactly. So they can park here, it's nice and flat. As you can see our van. Is yeah, nice because this is not a very flat area, as you may know. We are on a very steep road, so we suggested them to drive the long way and then come downhill because we we, we don't know how the van is doing, so we don't want them to have problems on the road or any issue. Uh, so we suggested them to Drive a little bit longer, but safer. Are you happy, Luce? Si contenta, amore? Si, you can see her little two teeth. <laughs> Is Have she smiling? Yeah. Luce? Luce? <laughs> I can spot a van up there. From UK. New friends, uh, Luce. Van lifers. We have our babies. <laughs> So cute. funny, it is literally like our babies. Like, yeah. The little ones. Um. <laughs> He's a little bit scared really? of boys. Yeah. So yeah. Scared yeah. of guys. But you have beard, so it's good. Yeah, yes. familiar. Yeah, familiar. Yeah. <laughs> familiar. I look familiar. How was the road? Oh, it was fine. It yeah. Was, yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Just okay. have to put the brakes on a lot. And yeah. I was worried, like, can I smell the brakes? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ciao. 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 So we have Tanya and Adam. How is the name of your channel, guys? Jets and. Jets into the sunset. I didn't, I didn't plan this. 
Yes, but yes. Um, Perfect. We, we have very few clothes in our van, so the, the, it always seems like we're wearing the same thing. Of course. <laughs> Branded up. Yeah. Jits into the sunset because we live in our van, Jits, and now we are cooking for you beautiful people. In a kitchen this size is a novelty. This is like four times what we're used to. More. Thank yeah. you guys for the treat and welcome to Lucky Land. Don't say thank you until you tasted it, because who knows? No. Uh, <laughs> I, thank you for the preparation. <laughs> then we will, we will tell you what you Look, I like. could judge. Usually yeah, he's yeah, judging. Yeah, yeah. We will tell you. Yeah. Cooking for Italians yeah. is always scary. Luce, he will tell you. What you want to do? You can say yes or no. I think. Good. Where is Triggy? Wait, down. we didn't introduce He's down here. It's a trigger. Trigger! 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 This way. Say hello. Trigger. He's confused. Say hello. Ciao, beautiful people. Ciao, <laughs> ciao. Just like and subscribe. <laughs> like and subscribe, please. <laughs> And oh, help support. <laughs> so this recipe is from a book that I think is called the Green Roasting Tin. Yeah, Green Roasting Tin. And it's, it's on page one hundred. Page one hundred, <laughs> if you're interested. <laughs> and it's this like sweet potato with tomato, ginger, chili. There's peanut butter, and it's just all these wow. flavors. And we have made this so many times, maybe 50, 60 times, and whenever we meet with anybody, we always cook it. So It's the go-to, isn't so it? So with Alex and Emma from the Travel Beans, we were with them uh, for three weeks, and then it was one of the first dishes that we made, and during this time, kept we it. kept having it. It was on demand. <laughs> uh, with Nikki and Carlo, Carlo was like, yes, we must have this again. So I really hope that it holds up to re the reputation, and then you want uh, you this want, you want for breakfast, breakfast maybe. <laughs> so <laughs> that, that would be like 10 out of 10 review. But this is a, yeah, it's a great one because we can make it in the van. It's quite easy to do. And it's also quite cheap because it's sweet potatoes and onions and tomatoes. It's fine at any way. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a good van life recipe yeah. as well. If you've got an oven in your van. <laughs> yeah. yeah, or an omnia oven. Or an omnia oven. Yeah, okay. you can always, you can always improvise. When okay. it's fan life, you could always improvise. I can't wait to try it. Yeah. Yeah, we've hyped it up now. It better live up to <laughs> that level. No pressure yeah. Yeah, exactly. at all. There you go. It doesn't look so good. Yeah, yeah. Lucas, since you want to give some tips because you are not happy yeah, otherwise. I, I, I'm the bad guy who's always uh, asking uh, wrong questions. Uh. Does he need to peel it or not? No. The skin. No. Trying to get me in trouble and uh, trying to add the stuff. Uh, so, because uh, I cannot eat uh, the um, ginger? ginger, so I already had to modify the. <laughs> in the Italian, I did ginger in Italian. <laughs> Ruin. The ginger. Zenzero. Zenzero. Okay. Um, and we have. Uh, Bay leaves. Bay leaves, yeah. yeah. Bay leaves uh, here at Lucky Land and also rosemary. Look at twist. Ah! So if it all goes terribly wrong, it's my no. fault. Yes. It's yeah, fault. exactly. I can uh, assume all my. Uh, the <laughs> Whoa. Uh, what was that? Because she wants to be the star. So Sorry, Luce. Too much yeah. attention uh, over there. Uh, and why you the potatoes? <laughs> Luca, your moment of truth. Okay, how many I'm allowed to put? Uh, you are the, you are, this is your twist, so you decide. I would One. say oh, sorry, this is your two twist. or three, it's too much. Let's <laughs> put three. What? Isn't five your lucky number? It's yeah, five. but it's two, five is too much. <laughs> or eleven. It's or too much. Eleven. Eleven. Lucky number. Okay, so now put it here. here. Mitipa, mitipa. She will put it in her mouth. 100%. See? Ta da! Keep it away from the baby. Wow, interesting. There was no uh, ginger, there was no garlic. 
We swapped and we, we added bay leaves. Tanya forgot the chili. I forgot the chili. We put in rosemary. So this is a total mix. We don't know what we're getting. We've also never had it with this grain stuff. Yeah, so basically it's a totally different it's recipe. Totally different. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Approved. Uh. Approved. Oh, yeah. 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 Thumbs up. Smash the like button. Subscribe. <laughs> we'll see what he says when the camera's off. It's just a performance. <laughs> you will see the day. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you like it, Lucha? Mmm. Mmm. Would you like some? It's good. Oh. Okay, promise that's weird. Let's do it. Okay, okay. Your friend is here. This is so funny. Where's the camera? 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 Oh, serious look for a second now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> hey! They cook for us uh, and in exchange. Uh, they're having the hot tub now. <laughs> That's a big, big treat. That's a big when, treat. Uh, when you have limited water in the van and your hair is greasy yeah, and greasy and dirty, and we we came here for 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 clean, for cleanliness. So here we go. <laughs> and have been on the road for so long, we know how much you appreciate. Uh, Having bees, uh, having a real kitchen, uh, having electricity, unlimited water. So, house life. Sometimes house life is good, right? Yeah. yeah. So especially when you are on the road. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, especially you in winter. Need, yes. In winter, in winter is even worse because in summer you can take a shower wherever you wherever you want. But when it's colder, and now they are here in north of Italy, and it, it's. Yes. Oh. Snowing outside. Yeah. And we get two towels each, one for our body and one for our hair for the five star experience. So, <laughs> you know, you're pulling out all the stops. Okay, they will be putting a good review. On. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, guys, enjoy. Thank you very much. Ciao, ciao. ciao, ciao. ciao, ciao. Beautiful day outside. It's like it just dream morning. Time. Lucia is taking a nap, and we will be doing a podcast very soon, indeed, together with Tanya and Adam. It's very exciting. This is something pretty new for us podcasting. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Welcome, welcome. Podcast studio where the magic happens. So, we are about to record a very in depth, intimate reveal everything podcast with you guys if you search jits into the sunset wherever you get your podcasts you'll be able to find us there and it's called, uh, the, it's called the travel adventure and road trips po podcast, podcast by jits into the sunset yeah perfect and you'll be able to find this how long have you been traveling with this van 
three four, years. Over three years now yeah. it is. Yeah. Yeah, all over Europe and most recently it's yeah, we've we've been travelling around Italy, which we've absolutely loved. And yeah, we love living in a van. We love van life and the freedom that it gives us all the reasons why you love it too so yeah it's our it's our little home yeah we've here. been very lucky yeah we've had a few breakdowns and it's a very old rusty van um from the 90s so not as old as some vans out there but we definitely have reliability issues <laughs> so yeah. that's been fun but yeah the amount like the freedom and the amount of incredible places we've got to see because of this van it's just so cool yeah and you just get really attached to yeah. bands. Yeah, we yeah. can relate. Yeah. To yeah. <laughs> Let's start. Let's All do right, it. Wicked. We Your can seat? also have see Luce here. So uh, she's here. actually out there. You can see it uh, she's yeah. there. She's <laughs> sleeping. In the sun, she's sleeping. So, so we, we have an eye on her. Yeah. Today we're having a Michelin star restaurant experience, all made by Sarah, the Michelin star chef. It contains nettles from the garden fresh nettles with the most pure rainwater that you have ever imagined. Potatoes. Yes. What other flavors? We have some leek. Yeah. Some shallot. Uh huh. And then that's it. Extra virgin olive oil, of, oh, course. of course. And if you want, you can check out this recipe in our cookbook. Yay! La vita è buona. Life is good. I will put the link in the description below this video. This is a great way to support your channel. Exactly. There you go. So, why not? We're so good at this. That's a, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> okay, moment of truth. What does it taste like? Oh my God, it's amazing. Yeah? Yeah, that is really, really nice. Woo. Look, it's not what I expected. It doesn't, I didn't know what nettle soup would taste like, but it tastes really creamy. Mm. Let me go sting on that stinging nettle. It's picking. so yeah. creamy mm. and rich. Yeah. This is lovely. I never blend soups, but all the soups I make are always okay. chunky. Yeah. But blending it makes it really like mm -hmm. smooth and creamy. So nice. Yes. And now it's time to make a little tour of Jit, of the van. Let's, Let's go inside. Let's knock on the door, Lucia. Lucia, knock on the door. Knock on the door. Hello! Hello! Come on in! Thank you! Our humble abode. You good? Oh! <laughs> oh welcome! Now I have to close the door. <laughs> <laughs> okay, one to reality. Oh, I can do it if you want. In winter. Okay, and bump. So, what should I, should I show the kitchen first? Yeah. So, we have a full mini kitchen. This is the hob here two hobs it all runs on gas an oven there which we use as storage when we're not mm -hmm. using it so they, they run on propane yeah lpg which is in the cupboard here okay mm -hmm. um sink here mm -hmm. it's a bit of a mess actually but there it is that's van life it's reality <laughs> this is our drinking water it's got a, it's attached to a filter um how many liters do you have drinking water, fresh water today? Of fresh water, we have 75 liters. Okay. Which is okay. And we've got a hot water. Actually, so we've got a hot water of about 10 liters. So I think we have about 85. Okay. We have a fridge, of course. Sound nice. falling out of it. Storage up here. Storage everywhere. This is all kitchen storage. Well, that's toothbrush and toothpaste and random bits and things but look at our spices look how messy our spices are like quite often you will see like van lifers will have like these really posh spice racks and we just have this mess and as every time we drive like one of the lids will fall off we have the same in our house do you oh so, we didn't yeah. have okay good yeah, fine like, same mess so. it smells nice though more storage under here now food yeah. food i think the main thing to say is that it's not a, a van that we converted. She has come self-converted by professionals that were probably inspired by boat design. So the great thing about Jits is that she's really modular and that every little bit of space is utilized so well. So storage everywhere, even for such a small van. So that's why we really, really love her. And right now we are sitting in the living room. Okay. But sometimes 
at night time it is a bedroom i have a question yes up here is a second bed or is it just storage we use it all as storage up there but it can be used as a second bed yeah because this used to be in my mum's van and i inherited it when she passed away in 2019 and she would have slept up there when she used it she slept up there yeah and that is my mum yeah and dogs Ciao, mama. Ciao, mama. As you can see, the driving uh, seat yeah. is on the right uh, because uh, it's you from the wrong way in Italy. Uh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> because uh, it comes from UK, and also the plugs, uh, as you can see, yeah, are the same one uh, in Australia. And what we also like is that this chair swivels around, mm -hmm. and it really opens up the space. There's a seat belt on here, yeah. and the thing that you guys are sat on now that folds up. Mm -hmm. And then that's a seat and it's got a seat belt on it as well. So it's four so you four can drive seats. four yeah. people, yeah. She fits in just She wants to check everything. Uh, she's so Are curious. There is also a, a door here. Yes, the sliding side. door. When I, I made them park uh, up there uh, where the house is. In our van, the sliding door is on the other side because yeah. the driving seat is on this side. So I said, okay, you come uh, and park like this and then I realized but it's the opposite that the sliding door is on the other side so it's, are, you, are you opening the door yeah we do in the summer in the summer we always have it open yeah, okay. yeah it's really that's nice. that's what we love about jets is that there's so many windows there's the doors like lots of ventilation very yeah mm -hmm. and it's very light yeah it's a 1999 Peugeot boxer yeah. and it's converted by a company called auto sleep they were super 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 technologic so, at the time uh, yeah so there's so many great details about the van that we really like well for example we really like this fold down table here this is really good with all the plug sockets behind it because that just disappears up but what i was going to show you is that the blinds you've got the blackout blinds yeah. like that as well as our curtains but then it also comes down like that and you've got the fly screens this is really good because sometimes when we're parked up like in a car park or somewhere that's more busy, we can still have it like this and people can't see in hardly yeah. at all when it's like this, so it still feels really private. Big question, do you have a toilet? We do have a toilet. That is the most important room. There's oh, rubbish yeah. on the floor at the moment, but that's just part of life. You can see the true mess of van life. There you go, guys. And that is sometimes where our rubbish goes when there's no bins around. That is the toilet. There is a sink here, so this pops down like that oh messy squidgy soap um hello and there is the shower and the shower operates on gun so that when you're not using it the water isn't just coming out <laughs> it's a better way of saving saving water oh, i've got myself wet no demonstration on how we no that. demonstration okay. this van is a quite a bit wider than sprinter vans okay. yes. so that you can fit that way it's like the fiat ducato okay yeah it's the same i think they made a fiat ducato and a peugeot boxer and they're the yeah. same they're the same yes. body what you can do is you can put the driver's seat right the way forward yeah there's an extra bit that, that goes, in, goes there. in the middle there uh -huh. and here and you can make this whole area the whole area will become a bed so we like can this. truly sleep the six of us all together in the van. <laughs> this is yeah. the next challenge. The next challenge. All six of us in the van. Next video. Next video. Yeah. But uh, in, during uh, during uh, summertime. summertime. Yeah. 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 Yes, yeah. Although we do have a heater. Diesel heater. A right? diesel heater. Yeah. It's just. I mean, I can't really. You can't really see it, but the the outlet is there, so the hot air gets pumped out of there, um, and it's just controlled by this little operation there what about solar panels and energy electricity yeah. batteries batteries so we have i think it's is it 200 or 300 watts of 300. So, 300 so we have 300 watts of solar panels literally every square inch of the roof that isn't taken up by vents and other things is solar panels we just put as much as we could on so it's 300 watts uh we have two 100 amp hour batteries and we have a one thousand watt inverter i think i'm getting all the numbers right um and we also have a battery to battery charger so when we're driving that charges up our batteries and it takes about so if the batteries were to be down to 10 percent, it takes about three and a half hours of driving to get them back up to 100 so it's really efficient i think that it's amazing how tall it is and how big uh, i mean we we went to germany we saw so many 
vans uh, and uh, even new ones uh, they are they weren't so tall and uh, it's it's amazing uh, how spacious and I love the fact that you can choose uh, you have the freedom to choose so many options uh, and uh, setups uh, for each day or each project that you need to do in that day it's mm. amazing I like it is a uh, six meters of van how, how long just is? below six i think so it's, it's a, a short it's a short, short wheel van so it's amazing because you can basically go everywhere yeah and uh, it's a size that is perfect for italy europe uh, that it's not like uh, in the united states and yeah. canada <laughs> in america <laughs> where bigger is better you know but uh, here in europe uh, it's better to be small because the roads are small mm. and uh yeah, sometimes uh, you can find yourself uh, that you need to turn around. Uh, so if you have a short vehicle like this, uh, you can still manage to turn around in a small road. Uh, it's the perfect size. Like it's just unfortunate because she's old that we've got lots of rust issues and we've had mechanical issues. So it's not all plain sailing. But yeah, if 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 this van was reliable, perfect van, I think for for us. Thank you so much, Tanya and Adam, for this amazing van <laughs> tour and for being here at Lucky Land. Oh, thank you for having us. It was amazing to make new amazing. friends. It's always nice and we need this, guys. We need this after everything we have been going through. Uh, this was just really a breath of fresh air, new friends, a lot of love, good energy, good vibes. I just want to tell you, yesterday we had a podcast uh, in here where we were posted uh, by your post podcast, yeah. <laughs> uh, which you will find the link in the description box uh, below the video. It is one of our first podcasts, so I don't know how it went. Oh, you were amazing. <laughs> so, yeah, you were very good. Very good. Uh, really honest and open. And yeah, we just really appreciate being able to have this conversation and, and to share it with more people. Yeah, yeah. it was a very nice experience also for us. Do you want to do a podcast as well? <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Yeah, she wants to. Thank you, beautiful people, for coming along with us. If you like today's episode, please share it to us. Uh, doing what? You have to give it a like, smash Thumbs the up. like button, <laughs> hit the notification bell, and please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel if you haven't done already, so you can't miss Lucha's chatting. You know, yeah, this she's, is so <laughs> she's trying. That's like baby talk for please subscribe and share the video. <laughs> <laughs> the Italian words for today's video are amici, friends, bacio, which means kiss. And piccolo cane, which means little dog. Yeah, I again. Think, is that a good pronunciation? Amici, friends, piccolo cane, that which means uh, small dog, uh, and uh, bacio, 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 which means keys. Mm. So with a lot of keys, uh, we will let you go, and uh, we will see you next Sunday. And remember, la vita è bella. Life is it's beautiful. beautiful. <laughs> ciao, thank you, ciao. guys. Ciao, guys. We love you. Ciao, ciao. Are you freezing, Lucha? <laughs> no, you're not freezing. <laughs> you so cute. <laughs>